Hey everybody, it's James. How you doing today? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have a YouTube commenter. That means you right there pick. Uh, this was brought up a couple weeks ago and I saw the comment and I didn't know anything about it or heard about it. So I asked my boys and they said, absolutely, you need to watch that movie. And they were surprised to know that it's a Christmas-based movie. So that's what we're doing. We are watching Grumpy Old Men. What do I know? I know it's a story about grumpy old men. That's what I know. <laughs> that's all I know. That's the whole point of this channel. I know nothing. <laughs> that's the whole point. I hope you enjoy this reaction. If you do, give me a like and subscribe. Push that up button. It really, really helps the channel. So if you're uh, interested in the full reaction of this, it's available on my Patreon. Go check it out. Thanks a lot. Let's watch Grumpy Old Men. Uh, heat way. <laughs> a tropical. And they're all ice fishing. Wabasha. Where are we in the world? But there's no driveways. Mr. Gustafson, will you answer the door, please? Who are you? Coming back here. Me. He's got a ladder <laughs> on this side of the house. What is going on? He's escaping. There's a letter for you, Mr. Gustafson. Morning, dickhead. Hello, Hello. moron. What? <laughs> you got yakking at your door. Just mind your own business. Why don't you tie your shoelace? You'll oh, fall on your up. stupid head. <laughs> Oh my gosh, these two know each other, obviously. I wonder if you gentlemen could tell me, Sorry. Mr. John Gustafson? That's right. <laughs> He's John, obviously. The uh, low life, ass oh. wipe, egg oh. sucker, John Gustafson. <laughs> <laughs> Always hanging out around those kinky strip bars where the men take their clothes off. <gasps> oh. <laughs> Believe me, this man is a menace. Uh -huh. Have you seen him? No, no. No? No. Contact Mr. Snyder yes. as soon as possible. Uh -huh. Oh, moly. Wow, that's a big sculpture. Jesus. No, <laughs> it's Jesus. It is. Men's strip joint. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, there's a history. These two have a history. Internal Revenue Service, IRS. Okay, that's a problem. Cold enough for ya? Oh, shut up, fat ass. <laughs> 1 44 a.m. Ooh, Ooh snowmobiling. Woo, fun. Oh, it's a woman. Lovely redhead. Yeah, we're gonna have this, uh, Little rivalry over the girl? Is that what's gonna go on here? Green Hornet's caught more fish than you've lied about. Yeah, the Green Hornet. <laughs> Even though it's the shape of a duck. Did you hear about Eddie Hicks? Hypothermia's a bitch. Give me a cardiac any day. You know what Jacob said? Henschel was killed in a car crash. Lucky bastard. Lucky bastard? <laughs> Jacob. Oh, he's fine. Promise to come over for Thanksgiving. Is he really going to run for mayor? Good thing he's his mother's son. If he looked like you, he'd never get in the ballot. Oh. <laughs> There's some zingers going back and forth between these two. Oh. I hit the cans again. Is this an ongoing thing? Give me waxworms. Waxworms are 75 cents. You could retire in Florida just from selling me worms. <laughs> Is Pop out there at the shanty? Always. And the moron? Should be room enough for the both of you. Oh, so this is, the whole town knows about these two. I have never been to, like, a ice fishing town. That's what these are. They're little tiny towns that just get set up in the middle of winter. Someone moved into the Klickner place. Woman, did you mount her? Oh, my God. <laughs> it's a train. Oh! He took all his beer! Get your hole cleared out. There you go. So for those of you that don't know, ice fishing, you have these little huts. They're ice huts. There's an actual hole in the floor. People have like radios and CD players and 
of the record players and uh, TVs and everything out there. And they just sit out there all day and fish. And they're heated. Uh, not highly heated, but a little bit heated. Two fish. Green Hornet strikes again. Oh, the Green Hornet. Oh my gosh. But I throw back what I'm not going to eat. What are you doing? No. Oh my god, that's going to stink up. If it gets warm at all, it's going to stink up that whole car. Do come for me. Oh, it's 1.30 in the morning. Is the IRS there? At 1.30 in the morning? Oh, no. Oh. oh. Hi. Oh, it's a woman. Just wondering if I might use your bathroom. At 1.30 in the morning? Is your bathroom broken? Oh, no, thank goodness. What? It's not broken? Oh, there's there it is. I can't wait to see what I find in there. There's a guest bathroom, please. I'll only be a minute. Oh, uh, <laughs> who is this woman? So she came over to intrude and go rifle through his bathroom? I love all the woodwork. My manners, I'm so sorry. I'm Ariel Truax. You and Max Goldman have been stuck up against your windows watching me like heterosexual or homosexual. That's a perfectly legitimate question. Funny, but here in Minnesota. <laughs> <laughs> Would you like me to leave? No. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's 1.30 in the morning. All right, now careful, fellas. Oh, are they taking the piano? Hi, Dad. How are you? Mm, good. Mike and I aren't fine. We're going to separate for a while. I never liked him anyway. Oh, okay. Hey, <laughs> there you go. Oh, I've done this. Yeah, get your body all hot. Jump into the snow. And then jump back into the hot again. I've done it with hot tubs. I've never done it with saunas. Ooh, playing the lotto. Here we go. Hey, Jacob, you got my vote. That's terrific. I'll be with you in a second. What's the alarm for? That's our estimated jackpot tonight. Ah! He's changing the channels on the TV. The schmuck doesn't know what's happening. <laughs> what are these commercials? <laughs> well, <laughs> Cold. Yeah, I figured it out. You. You're a trial. Apologize. A oh, come on. Apo oh, <laughs> go apologize. Oh, oh no. <gasps> Ain't that you criminal? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> He's icing his roof. Put one of these in your yard. I'd be proud to, Jake. I was surprised that hose works. It's so cold there. Why is he spraying the roof with water? Hey, dickhead, you win the lottery? Do you shower, smart ass? Yeah. Huh? Gotta use hot water, you schmuck. Pew! What the hell is that smell? Oh, the fish! I forgot about the fish! <laughs> you say she's all alone? She's available and hot to trot. Max was telling me about your new neighbor. Just listen to Casanova, will you? He's a regular Don Juan. No wonder the ladies don't want anything to do with you. Oh! <laughs> Tell me something, Chuck. Do I stink? Yeah! I could smell it in the car. <laughs> if it's the fish. Is it me? Yep. No. <laughs> yep. Damn. <laughs> I love this. Oh, look at <laughs> He smells like eight car fresheners. This is so good. Polara. I don't even know what kind of car that is. Oh, found the fish. Oh, well, he's watching hockey. Oh. Grab it. Hey there, you little bastard. <gasps> oh no, it went down the hole. Oh, he lost his green hornet. You're supposed to be smoking filter cigarettes, Pop. I'm 94 years old. What the hell do I care? Yeah, I'm 94. What, what do I care? What is he doing? Oh, he lost his, his green hornet, even though it's a duck. 
always knew, you know. Oh. Watch me with your dad's binoculars. Never wondered why my curtains were open just enough. I thought you said Chuck was going to VFW. Oh, he came to meet the new woman in town. <laughs> they both hit the tr trash cans. I knew that would be an ongoing joke. They're both there to see how the date went. Oh, come on. We saw you. You were there half the night. There's some experiences in life too rich to put into words. Oh, he laid it on thick for him. Your old pal failed you, huh, Chuck? Oh, no. Ariel reminded me that I was alive. It was like being young again. Well, that's nice. Couldn't get it up, huh, Chuck? <laughs> Oh no, the I'm Too Sexy song. That's... Oh, it's the Home Alone. Do not give those to her. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, he beat him over there. He brought those chocolates. <laughs> She's gonna die. TV, it's got oh. no guts. Oh, they put a fishbowl in the TV. Everyone needs some form of Release. Would you do me the honor of accompanying me to my ice shanty tomorrow? Going to the ice shanty. Oh, it. oh she's got a fish. Wow, look at that fish. Magnificent. Magnificent. He's a damn record breaker. Oh, I can see the beauty in the snow. And then the release. What release? There's no release. Yeah, no release. You know, eat it. This monster on my wall. Oh, he wants to stuff it. No stuffing. Nobody's going to believe me. Oh. Nobody's gonna believe me! Uh-huh. Let's see, let it go. <laughs> Nobody's gonna believe me! Hey, just finishing breakfast. Where'd you get this fishing pole? Oh, I uh, snagged it. He caught his pole! Oh, it's locked. Chuck! Oh, no. I think we're gonna be great friends. Friends? Friends is good. Uh, well, Gustafson looks like the best man won. He's dead. Chuck died? Last night in his sleep. Yeah, all right, fine. You want to clock me? You think you can take me? Come on. Oh, no. Are they going to actually fight? It's not worth the effort. <gasps> oh, why? Damn you, Goldman. Not. Oh. It's the IRS guy. I'm asking you to accompany me to my office. Oh no. They didn't drop him back off. Hi. Oh, it's Ariel. If it's too exciting and then I'm up all night. Good. I'm making Szechuan. She wants to keep him up. It's a wonderful evening. Thank you, Ariel. Never mind, she broke into your house. Soon you'll be gone. And all you have, see? Is the experiences well said? Mount the woman, son. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh my gosh, they're moving. Whoa, jeez, that was not them. <laughs> oh. <laughs> you believe in angels? Oh, they're all around us. I think I see one. Yeah, he does. Look at how large Paco's. Oh yeah, watch me spray paint this guy's head. <laughs> I'll have you made it in three moves. Shouldn't we get to know each other a little better first? <laughs> and these little guys. <laughs> it's me and the moron. Oh no! How do they end up living right next to each other? Oh! Going in for smooches. I think it's kind of late. Denied. A little too aggressive. I said it's time for bed. Oh! I'm not prepared. These days you have to do safe sex. John, when was the last time you made love? 1978. Oh! <laughs> oh, I think we're safe. I think we're safe. Yeah! I think we're safe. Okay. He got lucky. And here she comes leaving his house. For you, Thank I, you. I, I. Oh, look at him go! <laughs> He's in a really good mood. Yeah, his fishing rod. You need to give it back to him. 
Oh, he's got the beers in the lake. Yeah, he dropped it off and he put some new line on it and he fixed it. Oh, oh no, the ice isn't breaking, is it? The ice is moving. What is going on? He's pushing his shanty. He's, he's pushing his ice house. Oh, thin ice. There goes his whole ice shanty. He belongs in a rubber room. He belongs in a rubber room. I fixed your fishing pole. He's gonna replace her. Oh, <laughs> he took a swing and fell on his ass. Oh, no, oh, oh, geez, they are gonna fight. Oh, oh. Hey. oh there's a little Westie. Do you see the West Highland White Terrier? Oh, there you go. Broke my nose. Punch him. Break your tail. Your nose. She came to me. She ended up with May. You never would have had Amy. Loyal than May ever was. Oh. Huh? What? Huh? They're both confused. Well, did you? All right, we did uh, a horizontal mambo. It's the greatest sex I ever had in my life. Oh, oh no. <laughs> hey, trying to stab him with a frozen fish. Drop that fish. Yeah, drop the fish. Now go to your shanty, scaring the fish away. Yeah, you're scaring the fish. How are you going to take care of when the IRS takes your house away? Yeah, he knows about it. You know, you should be happy for your friend. Okay, Max. This time you win. No! No. No. Yes, no, 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 no. He doesn't win anything. It's a gift. A snow angel. Snow angel. It's beautiful. Dude, Ariel, I think it might be a very good idea if we didn't see each other. Mainly, I don't like you coming over here anytime you feel like it. You're being a jerk. I like being alone. I understand completely. I hate this. And Merry Christmas. Congratulations on the election. Oh, he won. <laughs> <laughs> Hello, Punch. Hey, Pop. I don't like this. She belongs with John, not Max. Hey, Mary. Uh, husband's with her. Be polite. Yeah, I thought you two were getting a divorce. I had to get some things worked out for myself. Maybe the rest of us should just put our lives on hold. You oil yourself up with enough booze and bullshit that you can make your mind up. You grab a beer, it's in the fridge. Sweetheart, I'm gonna walk down the slipperies. You know, Melanie said that John just exploded. So what's going on? Oh gosh, it's gonna come out. I don't like him. I never liked him. At least you could go down to Slippery's and make peace with the man. I'd rather kiss a dead moose's butt. Oh God, <laughs> a dead moose's butt? All right. Putz, do you love her? Make the whole thing worthwhile. Do you think you did? Give me back my old fishing pole and I told you thank you. you. Uh, oh, it's not about the fishing pole. Ariel. What about her? You made me feel sorry for you. Yeah. Chose me. No. It's a difference. You got her anyway. He let you have her. How is this going to end up? We don't have much longer. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is he having a heart attack? No. Makes a difference, damn it. Oh, go talk to people, John. Go, Max. Go, go, go. Go find him. At least they live next to each other. Hey, John. Help him. Are you dead? I don't want to die looking at your ugly face. Oh, gosh. Stay there. Stay right there. Where's he going to go? Go get help. Could you tell me where Mr. John... Are you friend or family, sir? Your friend. Friend? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> his face. Oh, he had to realize it. Oh, poor John. Is he okay? Merry Christmas, John. Oh. <laughs> this is sad. You better have a very good reason for standing me up this morning. What's wrong? Can I come in? Uh-huh. Yeah, of course. Oh, he's got the tube out of him. I'm gonna get rid of me, but isn't this a little drastic? Oh. <laughs> oh, poor John. I could be dead tomorrow. My hands are tied. Gustafson straight as a grizzly's dick. He'd never cheat on his taxes. <laughs> Ooh, about $13,000.
They're taking his house? Oh, this is baloney. Go see a lawyer. What'd you do? Why don't you do the world a favor and pull your lip over your head and swallow? Oh, God. <laughs> you got a what? problem here, sir. Barricaded the doors. Yeah, they have. Got it, Pop. Just like you said. I got a 30-day cease and desist order from the court says you can't touch this house. Oh, good for you. Here it comes. <laughs> What are we doing? Uh, sorry about the uh, divorce. Right. Okay, so the divorce is final. Ready for this? No, not really. Oh God, did John die? Get your asses in here! Oh God. <laughs> okay, Grandpa. He's wearing a tux. Are they getting married? They are getting married. Yeah. Look how lovely she is. <laughs> Look at the whole friggin' town is there. Jacob got him to waive the penalties and the interest, and I took care of the 13 grand. Oh. Just alone. Oh, that's nice still. Yay, happy ending. Smell something. What is that? Oh no, did he put a fish in the limo? He did. <laughs> what a putz. Oh, she's next door. That's right. Go over and say hi. Yeah, come over. You got there? Broccoli. Oh, broccoli. Yeah. Yakking about. It's a shame that your uncle has a fish market on 23rd. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh. I'm Ronald Reagan. I live across yes. the street. Are you, I'm Ronald Reagan. <laughs> Tomcat on the prowl. Yeah. <laughs> Taking the skin boat to Tuna Town. Oh! Who left? <laughs> <laughs> I bet that was so much fun to make. Let's talk about it. That was Grumpy Old Men, and boy, were they ever Grumpy Old Men! <laughs> Boy, they've got some history, I swear. They they were little kids together. I, I don't know if their, like, parents owned the houses and then they took over the houses, so they've always been next door. I don't know what that story is. I mean, obviously they've owned these houses since their kids were around because she he was sneaking peeks on her and she was letting it happen. But it's so funny but there was a really sad part in that end there man that kind of shocked me it took a big turn um towards sad um uh, ended good of course you know we got a happy ending but just i bet this was just so much fun to make i didn't know anybody in this entire movie i didn't know anybody in the cast that i could recognize um but it's just it's very, very funny. How much is it associated with Christmas? Eh, about this much. <laughs> I wouldn't call this a Christmas movie, but, you know, it's the holiday timeline, you know, between Thanksgiving and Christmas. Who knows how long it was between them getting, you know, before they got married. But, uh, yeah, it was a great pick. So, Whoever commented grumpy old men out there in the comment section on YouTube, thank you very much. It has been reacted to. If you want to see the full reaction to this or any of my full reactions or get the reactions before everybody else or get commercial free reactions or help pick which movies I watch, check out my Patreon. The link is above or below and it's not very expensive and you get lots and lots of extras. So thank you so much for watching, and as always, don't ever forget that you are awesome. Don't ever forget it. We'll see you next time. Bye.